Um, fuck with your boy Angry Fan 007, man. Shout out to the whole Angry Fan movement. Niggas, let's talk about this T-Top and Matt battle, right? Now, first and foremost, I'm going to be totally real with you. T-Top 3 old, and we already know that shit. I don't really feel like it was really a body bag, though. I'm going to tell you why, bro. When Big K battled half past seven, even though Big K choked, that was a body bag. When JC battled Time Bomb, that was a body bag. When Soul Calm battled Deacon Frost, that was a body bag. When Soul Calm battled um, J Fox, that J Fox tried to hide from this nigga on stage, that was a body bag. To me, a body bag is it don't matter what your opponent says, you know what I'm saying? You gonna win through all three rounds clearly. Calico, in my opinion, body bag math. You know what I'm saying? It's just like. There was no chance for your opponent because your material was hitting so crazy, they just lost it. I kind of feel like Matt played a part into this right here. He's all over the place. He's stumbling. For, he's choking. Telling niggas to quiet down. Ain't nobody even talking. Fucking, uh, um, that's the, the end of his third was terrible. The way he just said, I'm about to go make some CDs. It was just like, whoa, what, nigga? Like, oh, wow, okay. Like, look, like you just you just waved the white flag right there and pretty much said, I'm done with battle rap damn there, it seemed like. You know what I'm saying? So it's just like I really feel like Mav was fucked up in the head. Now I'm not giving Mav no pass at all, but I'ma be real with you niggas. Y'all gotta stop being fanatics and just be a goddamn human being. Mav had a baby the same day. That's the reason why I, I can't get wild, stupid, crazy. You and I both know if your girl had a baby right now, your ass would be leaving work or your ass would be calling out of school, or whatever the fuck you do during the time with your fucking day. Let's be real. We just so tired of the bullshit from Mav. The the the. the, the Smoking cigarettes during your battle, your, your fucking battling head ice in the goddamn robe looking crazy, playing on, which is one of the worst battles out right now on YouTube recently. It's just like we're tired of the bullshit from math. That's what, that's really what it is. We tired of the excuses, the joker, I was hungry, this, that, but we're tired of all of that shit. That's what we're tired of. So that carried over onto this right here. But the reality of the, the other thing, same with Rex. I didn't really go crazy killing Rex. Bruh. The nigga had a, a, a traumatic event the same morning. We ain't talking about the same week. We talking about the same day. I still feel the same way. You got to be a human being before a battle rap fan, my nigga. So, like, I can't kill Matt, but then again, I can. Because I'm going to tell you why. Matt, you really, it's, it's fucked up, but you're not in a position to have any bad battles. I know you feel like you a legend, you a vet, and, and you paved the way, and you did this, and you did that. I understand you. The face of URL years ago, I get all that. Right now, presently now, you're not in a position to be losing no battles, my nigga. I know you're just 3-0 Luciano crack. I get it. You're going to fuck around and go, yeah, I just caught a body. We don't give a fuck about that, man. I'll be totally G with you. We don't give a fuck about that. You shouldn't be battling Luciano crack if you want to keep it real. He lost to JC. He's down with SMS. I'd rather see you battle conceded than see you battle uh, Luciano crack, my nigga. It just is what it is. So it's just like you're at a real... A, a, a real crazy time right now. The, the, it's looking like the torch is passing. We seen Rum Nitty beat Charlie Clips. Uh, I'm waiting to see what's going on with Tink and Sway to see if Sway go hold it down. But fucking, uh, we just seen Top Thrash you. And I'm gonna be real with you, my, uh, my nigga. If you was to battle Briz a month from now, I don't think you could beat Briz. Don't mean I don't fuck with you. I just think that Briz is more hungry than you right now. You niggas gotta find a way to stay motivated. I'm not on no hating shit on some get these old niggas the fuck out of here. I'm on some... Get these niggas who's not hungry the fuck out of here. Had Ice is hungry. He's starving right now. He's doing his fucking thing. Cortez is doing his fucking thing. He's still a vet. You could Tay Rock is still hungry. He's still doing his thing. DNA, he's still hungry. He's still doing his thing. So you can still be here, but you gotta find a way to still be hungry. Whether it's money, whether it's I don't give a fuck what it is. You gotta find a way to deep to dig deep down and, and produce a good battle. Like why did y'all get in battle rap? To rep y'all shit, whether it's to sell music, whether it's just to be, to make your brand bigger, who the fuck know who the fuck care? But you gotta find a way to make that shit happen. Period. Because I'm gonna tell you what's gonna happen, man. I don't see you on King of the Dot. I really don't see you on URL. I don't see you on RBE. You might get on the Guerrilla Warfare, but it's like, like, what you gonna do? Battle on A-Hat? Like, what you gonna do, my nigga? What, we gonna see you on Spit That Heat? We gonna see you battling somebody on We Go Hard? A nigga from your status shouldn't even be thinking about taking these kind of battles. And that's where I'm coming from with this loose channel crack shit. Like, you gotta understand, this Mav Hoffa shit is your brand. Pac Juice is your brand. You gotta keep that shit up, my nigga, period. Or don't take the battle. Don't take another fucking battle if you're not ready to 3 0 somebody at this point. Like, you gotta show niggas why they even fuck with you right now. We know why back in the day, but your last couple of battles, you smoking Newport 1 millions and all this crazy shit. Oh, 
You know what I'm saying? It's not a good look. It's, it's just not a good look, my nigga. Period. That's just that. Okay? Newsflash, my niggas. You vet niggas are one by one disintegrating from battle rap and we are watching it. We don't see Hitman Holler battle like that. We don't see Calico battle like that. We don't see Surf battle like that. We don't see Old Red battle like that. We don't see fucking Averb. Well, Averb is battling, but we, he, even he's not on big ass platforms crazy like that no more. We don't see Young L's trying to come back. Fucking, um, we don't see Miles battle like that. We don't see fucking X Factor no more. Clean is just now trying to get his shit back together and shit. A lot of the vets, uh, Hollow battles once or twice a year. Lux ain't battling. Mook ain't battling. Uh, uh, you know what I'm saying? A lot of the vets, like, how can I put it? Like, y'all not, Arsenal's getting ready to retire this year. Like, y'all are going out, so it is a new era, period. The, the difference is, are you going to stay in this era or are you going to die with your peoples? Or are you going to just fall back and be like, all right, this is what I did for battle rap? I know you're not working, so I know you need some bread, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you could be working. I don't know, but I know battle rap money is good. You up there with a the grill and all this shit. Battle rap money is good. Let's keep it real. It's good. So you got to find a way to keep getting that battle rap bread. Period, my nigga. You got niggas who go to work. You think I like working, nigga? I don't like fucking working. You got niggas who go to work who have to go to work. I have to get paid to pay bills. I have to go to work. Let's be serious. I know you don't want to be in the fucking warehouse nowhere doing nothing like that. This piece, your niggas ain't selling platinum records. So, I mean, you got to find a way to stay motivated, my nigga, period. And these new niggas is hungry. Rum Nitty is hungry. Uh, uh, Chess is hungry. Steams is hungry. Show Off is hungry. Uh, 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 T-Top is hungry. Briz is hungry. These niggas are starving right now. Why the fuck should we want to see you over and over and over again give up these bullshit battles and we got these hungry niggas over here ready to kill each other. It's just reality. Take yourself out of Math Hoffa's shoes and put yourself in the average battle rap fan shoes. You know what I'm saying? It just is what it is, my nigga. And I know you're going to say, well, my Math Hoffa fans going to fuck with me. I dig all that shit. But at the end of the day, not enough Math Hoffa fans in the world is going to keep you on URL and you not having good battles, my nigga. And that's just a fact right there. So you got to get your shit together. Oh, that's for all the vets. I would love to see Charlie Clips go hand for three rounds and me get his nigga a good ass recap because I'm, I'm I'm back on Clips because Clips is back on this shit. I'm just not getting a chance to do it because he's not back. Period. You know what I'm saying? Like, we got to look at the situation for what it is. Why is it you not motivated but had Ice is still motivated? He over here going fucking bananas, going crazy. It's just reality, my nigga. Times is changing. You got NWX. You got gun titles. You not down with neither one of these niggas. Y'all see like... The battle rap is, is still moving forward. Whether you're, put it like this, whether you here or not, math, battle rap is going to move forward. You got to see, uh, it's up to you whether you're going to be on it. Now, you died at T-Top, that's the fuck you did. You got your ass killed by T-Top. I feel like you played the part. What's your next move going to do? I don't care about your Luciano ba uh, crack battle. And all battles count, yes, I don't care about that battle because I'm more disappointed that you even battled that nigga. You know what I'm saying? What are you going to do your next battle? Not even a year ago, I remember I was uploading your goddamn, um, your, 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 your songs coming at Surf and Ice, Ice and all this shit. Like, what happened? You ain't going to battle Surf. Like, I remember you really want to battle Surf. Right now, you are going so backwards. You might battle JC right now. We don't fucking know. And a nigga of your status shouldn't be battling them kind of battles is where I'm coming from. That's how I really feel. So even though it was a, it was a body bag, I don't think it's over for math. But I think math, it's, it's up to math, man. Period. He, he got to do something. He got to do something. I like a lot of angles Top had to in the battle with the whole you laughing and joking now. You can't say, uh, oh, I'm, I'm real this, I'm real that. But in your battles, you doing a lot of fucking jokes. You know what I'm saying? And newsflash. I'm going to be real with you too, bro. Because ain't nobody really going to say it like this. But it does look like disaster fucked your career up. All right? Now, if that is still fucking with you... Let that shit go. Because I'm going to keep it real with you. It, it's not like when Diggs hit you, you was running. Or you was trying to grab niggas for shells and ducking and hiding. Nah. It, we, don't, we don't see that at all. We don't see that at all. You know what I'm saying? Ugh. Like when you came with angry fans, radio tomorrow, I don't see how that's a joke. Stop worrying about that shit. In this battle. Stop worrying about that shit. Because if you stop battling, then that shit did end your career. Then it ended your career. If you stop battling. But if you keep it pushing, then who the fuck knows what, my nigga? You might get a fucking a rematch. You know somebody like Alki David going to poke their head out somewhere and offer you niggas like 50000 to battle each other. Stop letting that shit handle what the fuck you doing, bro. We all seen the fuck happen. You out there by your goddamn self against the whole goddamn L.A. We seen it. Let it go. Fuck that shit. Let that shit go and go back to being that fucking Brooklyn Hoffa that we know. 
period. I wouldn't let this shit destroy me. Like I said, you had a child. I dig it. So I'm not going to go crazy hammering you. But at the end of the day, you are going to be the cause of your own death. Because I think that this shit is still fuck with you so much, you don't know what the fuck to do with yourself anymore. And newsflash, niggas are going to be bringing that shit up. I don't give a fuck how mad you are. They're going to bring it up because it happened. The same way niggas was bringing up you hitting Dose and you bringing up Serious Jones. You hitting Serious Jones and you thought it was funny. They're going to bring, they're going to do the same shit to you. You might as well get over that shit now. You know what I'm saying? That's how I really feel about that. Hit my description box. I got the two Serious Jones interviews that are going viral. Jones is going off. Talking about what he did. Talking about the Mount Rushmore. Trying to prove how, how he should be on it. We got the... um. What else do I got up in there and shit? I got Body Bag Battle League. I got the Flacco L versus Brooklyn Carter Battle. That shit was dope. I got fucking, um... And I got the Midwest Miles interview. He just recapped the rematch he had with Avery. You know what I'm saying? A from the fuck up. Let me know what you think about the battle. Fuck with me, nigga. One.